In this video, we will show you how to replace your fuel filler neck housing on this Dodge Ram. This will be located behind your left side rear fender. Let's get into it. Okay friends, let's get started on our job. The first thing you're going to want to do is open up your fuel filler door. The next thing that we'll do is make our way right over here to the fuel cap, turn that counterclockwise to remove it. Give the gasket a quick inspection and set it aside. Now behind that cap, you'll find that you have four Phillips head screws making their way all the way around. We'll use our Phillips head to remove each of these. Inspect the hardware as you remove it, replace it as necessary. Now that we've completed one of the bolts, do the same to all the rest. Once you've done that, let's safely make our way under the vehicle. With all four of those screws loose, underneath here, we'll just take hold of the filler neck, give it a little wiggle straight down and try to pull it off to the side. Now we can make our way back out here. We'll be continuing by removing our three T20 torque screws that hold the housing to the fender of the vehicle. There's one. It's nice and loose. I'll leave it in there just a couple threads. Fully remove the final mounting bolt here. At this point, we can carefully reach in behind the fender well. We'll hold on to this and remove that mounting bolt. Now we can remove this from the vehicle. There it is, friends. All right, let's get ready for the installation of our filler neck housing. We'll come up through the back side of that fender and put this in the proper position. Once you have all three of your mounting holes lined up, we'll continue on with starting in each of our three mounting bolts for this. After they're all started, you can go ahead and snug them up. Right there is bottomed out. Just make sure it's nice and snug. Do the same to all. Now we can get our filler neck aligned with the filler housing here. We'll just slide this over and put it in position. Now, once you feel as though you have that aligned properly, let's make our way back to the outside and start in all four of our mounting bolts. Let's start in all four of these mounting screws. Once we have them all started, we can snug them up. Right there is bottomed out. Let's make sure it's snug. You don't need to apply too much pressure on this. You don't wanna strip anything out. Now we can reinstall our fuel cap on this. We'll listen for a click and close the door. Thanks for watching. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.